Hey folks, welcome back. I'm at the local in Warner, New Hampshire. And with me today is Bill Horlicker from uh, White Birch Brewing in Hooksett. Bill, how are you? Good. Thanks for having me back, Sean. Good to have you on. And it uh, looks like we got a milestone coming up here. We do. Well, fifth anniversary. Wow. It's, uh, it's been a fascinating five years making beer in the great state of New Hampshire. Oh, I can imagine. Uh, you guys wow. come a long way. You got a lot, lot more variety, a lot, some really good stuff too. Thank you. Um, you know, it's one of those things I love to brew. People like to drink it. I get to do it again. I mean, you know. Repeat business. I get to spend my day making beer. Oh, what a lucky guy. <laughs> <laughs> so we got a couple here. What do we got? Well, first is a surprise hit that I thought I'd tell people about in case you weren't on the end. Um, last year at a beer festival, I did a cask of Berliner Weiss, which is our summer sour German wheat beer. I did it up with blueberries. Ooh. Everyone went insane. Really? And all winter, when are you going to make it? When are you going to make it? I finally got the label done with the feds. I made it. And I thought, well, it's late for summer, but at least I got it out. We'll be staged for next summer. Everyone's like, I want more. So <laughs> That's a good thing. Uh, yeah, we've, we're still making it. It's winter. Um, it still tastes great. Well, and, beer tastes uh, good any time of the year. Oh, it does. It does. Um, so this traditional summer beer with a New England twist is now being made in winter, <laughs> only in New Hampshire. <laughs> Got to um, mix it up. And the other one? This one right here, I'm very uh, proud to say, is our fifth anniversary beer. Um, we started run. in 09. The economy was atrocious. <laughs> and I decided to make beer. Go figure. Hey. Um, but every year we've continued on as a company, I create an anniversary beer. It's special to that year. The idea is to celebrate that we get to do this another day, another year. Um, this beer is what I call a Royal Belgian IPA. It's a marriage of a double IPA, American barley wine, and a Belgian strong golden ale. It, it's elements that I like of each. So it came to 11.2%. It's got a real beautiful American hop profile. Lots of citrus, really big. Um, there's a little bit of sort of sweet quad type malt in the back, dark fruits if you don't know what a quad is. Um, it's smooth as can be. It's just one of those beers you want to end your night on a real good note Ooh. and you like hops, this is a beer to do it. I can't wait. <laughs> mm. So it's, it's, been a, it's been an amazing 2014 and next year we're looking at even bigger. Um, we have a new brew system coming. We're putting in our own canning line. Oh, nice. Um, you know, as a beer enthusiast myself, I love great beer, but I love great beer at a great price. And, you know, we try to do that with our 22-ounce bottles. Um, but now to be able to offer our beers in six-pack and four-pack format and to be able to get into that $9 six-pack price point. Perfect. Um, you know, it, it's everything you want, a unique, great beer at a package you like that's just a no-brainer and they can um and find they can find your beer they can go to your website and find out who carries your beer right we have a lot of great stores listed on our website um you know that's one of the things that's been really exciting for me um you know you look at the the globally owned brands the big national brands you see them stacked in pallets in all these high volume stores and you don't see us but in little places, in independent places, they've been the strength of our brand for five years, and that hasn't changed. Um, it's really exciting to see all these great little towns we're in and bars and just say, yep, we're there. We're there. Well, I can't wait to give it a try, folks. I recommend you give it a try. Bill's been doing this for a while, and uh, he makes a good product. And keep it local, right, Bill? Absolutely. That's your local view. Now back to you. <laughs>